Hey guys, I hope you're all doing well. In today's video, four endangered North Pacific right whales spotted in the Gulf of Alaska. 23 species removed from the Endangered Species Act due to extension. And then we take a look at some of the viewer submissions, plus whatever that thing is. But first, let's take a look at a few big storms occurring around the globe. We have Tropical Cyclone Golub, Hurricane Sam, and Super Typhoon Mindul. Ah, let's take a look at the information here in the upper left. It says this image of Golub was captured yesterday by NOAA NASA satellite Saumi. At the time, its sustained winds were about 60 to 70 miles per hour. And it's forecasted to reach hurricane level today. However, it will weaken before making landfall tomorrow or Monday. Mm, for Hurricane Sam, the NOAA 20 captured this image on September 26. Its sustained winds were around 145 miles per hour, which is about a Category 4 hurricane. At the time of imaging, it was centered about 600 miles off the coast of Friends, Guiana, and not expected to make landfall. Now let's take a look at Tropical Storm Mindol. Here's a Tropical Storm Mindol. As of September 26, it was in the Philippine Sea with a sustained winds of 165 miles per hour. It was expected to weaken and become equivalent to a Category 1 hurricane before reaching the waters of Japan today. Unfortunately, I couldn't find any recent information about this storm. Hopefully, it did weaken before reaching Japan and everyone is okay. Now, onto the sighting of the four endangered right whales. They were spotted in the Gulf of Alaska. This article covers why the North Pacific right whale is endangered and why this sighting was so important to the scientist. It also shows a map of where the sightings took a place. Here you can see a video of the sighting. If you want to know more, a link to the article will be in the description box. The Fish and Wildlife Service proposed the listing 23 species due to extinction. This article covers some of the causes of extinction with climate change and natural area loss having the greatest impact. Here are some of the more important spaces to be delisted. And here is a list of the spaces to be delisted along with where they were found and when they were last sighted. As you can see, some haven't been seen for decades. First of all, I would like to say thank you to my nephew Marvin for sending in this video. I'll put a link to his channel in the description box. I had no clue what this was when I first saw it. It looks like some weird alien creature. He said it was a mud scorpion. I did a little research and determined that it is in fact either a mad lobster or mud shrimp. I'll put a link in the description box so you can read up on it yourselves. I'll let you guys watch the rest of it. Let me know in the comment section what you think about this strange creature. Ako kayo na iyang ulo mga kalods, oh. Puyo na siya, glatik niya. 
kung dire sa kalapukan mo ni siya yung kabkab o yuta bali maghimo siya kuan ba kanyang bangag dangan ni siya dire sa um, pali, palibot mga kalod here are a couple more submissions for today's video the first is a video from adam which is a lick off of a trail in south eastern mass and the second is a video of the orchids from the philippines which was sent in by alice delario she has a youtube channel which i'll link in the description box below Thank you all for watching and until next time, be well and stay safe.